Hi, I'm Kendall, Marketing Director at Vein Specialist of the Carolinas, and this is Dr. Drawn, and today he's going to be showing us how to properly measure for your knee-high and your thigh-high compression garments. So the two most important things about garments is they have to fit your leg. So you can't get your mom or your dad's or your daughter's or your sister's garment and try to wear those. They have to fit your leg. So when we measure patients, you're going to fit into a category of small, medium, large, and you're going to either be at the top end of medium or the bottom end of large. And so there's some variability. And so the reason we say garments were 20 to 30 is that if your leg is large for that size, close to the largest that that size can tolerate, your pressure will be more like 30. If your leg is small for that size, then your pressure will be more like 20. So when we talk about garments, we talk about a range of pressure, 20, 30, 30, 40, 40, 50, uh, because we don't know the exact pressure that you will get. And if your leg changes size by wearing the garments, swelling goes down, then obviously the pressure will be a little less. The two measurements that mean the most are the calf and the ankle. So most garments, measure the sizes with inches, but some of the brands want you to measure in centimeters. But our brand, Sibaris, goes by inches, so you take the smallest area of the ankle and you just get the, the number. So for Kendall, it's eight and a half. Then you go up to the calf and you find the biggest area of the calf, and you measure that, and Kendall's is 14. And then the next thing is the length. So turn this way. So you want to measure, pull your pants up just a little. So you want to measure to this crease. So you take the measure and, and you go to zero, put your foot flat on the floor, and then you measure to the crease. And if the crease, if it's more than 16 inches, and Kendall has long legs, hers is 18. So if it's more than 16 inches, then you would wear a long, and if it's less than 16, you would wear a, a short. So that's how you do the calf. For the thigh, the difference is you come up to the, the middle of the thigh and you measure the circumference here. And then to know the length of the thigh garment, you go to the crease of the buttock and the leg and you measure that distance with your foot on the floor, flat on the floor. And then that determines what length you would use for thigh high. Thank you, Dr. Drawn, for showing us exactly how to measure for the knee-high and the thigh-high compression garments. For more information, you can visit our website, veinscarolina.com, and click on the Compression Garment tab, and there will be more information there.